All right, a couple of other options with, with audio. Um, if I want to get rid of, of the audio in a track, um, I can go over here to the mute. Notice that will turn it off. But the problem is that turns it off on all of the clips in that track. So it turns off the entire track. So I may not want that. Another way that you can get rid of a, an audio clip that you that you don't want in there anymore is to simply delete it. So let's uh, let's unmute that, and we've got the, this clip playing. And to delete um, uh, the audio track from a clip, we go up to our selection tool, we select this uh, this clip, and then we go to the clip menu and click on unlink, and that separates the two. Now we can just click on the audio and hit delete, and it's gone. All right, so I've deleted the audio from the clips where I want to get rid of it. I've also put a little gap in here for uh, a place where I want to add a voiceover in a few minutes. And let's get ready to work with bringing in some music that will run underneath this video. So the um, music bed that I want to use for this video is, I already imported that when I imported the uh, all the video clips. And you're audio files look like this. And we can edit it in the source window the same way we did with the video clips. So if we double click it, we bring it up in here and we see the sound waves and we can start to work with this. So I've already listened to this and figured out the points at which I want to edit it. The first subclip that I want to make from this starts at four seconds and six frames. So we'll go to that point. Okay, so it's a little difficult with uh, with a big file like this to, to move um, very uh, precisely with the scrubber bar. But if I use the uh, uh, right and left arrow keys, I can move one frame at a time. So we'll make that at four, uh, four seconds and uh, six frames, and then put in our end mark. And then we're going to move out to 33 seconds and 10 frames. Oh, yeah. Okay. And move forward 10 more frames using the right arrow. And we'll put in our out mark. And then save this as our first subclip. Make subclip. And we'll call it audio one. Okay, we can see our audio one subclip down here in the project pane. Uh, the second uh, subclip I want to make uh, starts out at about the uh, two uh, two minute and thirty one second mark. So about in there. And we'll put in a new um, in spot. And then it continues until about the end of the... Keep it going to 257 here. Put in an end mark there. Mark out, and we'll save this subclip as um, audio two. And there's audio two down in the project pane. All right, so what I want to do next is bring in audio one, and I want it to start right at the beginning of the Tour of Qatar uh, clip. So we're going to drag it in here. And it'll lock in place right there when we let it go. And we'll look and see, this goes a little bit longer than I want to. I want this to, I'm gonna fade this out at this point. Okay, so to um, fade this music out, <clears throat> what I'm going to do is use the pen tool. And right in here, place my first mark, and then place two or three more and we're going to fade it out in about that amount of time. So this is our uh, beginning uh, full level and we'll start dragging these down. Let's 
episode. At that point, it's now inaudible.